just pulled over so I'll quickly chalk you through the mods that I've done to the Hunter. Right, so um, screen that was one of the first recently put the headlamp guard on bar end mirrors Givy rack Givy top box base plate um, engine bars um, spots Uh, this is the uh, seat, this is the signature seat, um, oh, N-CAN, stainless precision N-CAN, uh, and I think that's about everything for now, I can't think of anything else at the moment. I was hoping I'd have to wash it today, but I don't think, uh, looks as though it's going to have to be washed. Uh, yeah, I think that's everything. I think I've talked you through everything that I've uh, either added, ah, and the, uh, the big one is the, uh, the, the rev counter. Oh yes, and finally, um, I changed the, uh, I fitted a couple of shorty grips, adjustable short grips. These are great because my, uh, my hands are not big and it was a bit of a reach with the, uh, with the standard levers. So I replaced the uh, brake and clutch lever. And there he is really. Looks like he does got to have a wash again. Um, yeah, it's a job done. As I say, with the spotlights, they only really work with the engines running. Uh, so the engine running, the couple of settings on them, just to work with just the rings, which I quite like. I think that looks really nice. And uh, second setting. We've got the ring and the uh, and the high beams, and I think that'll just complement on the. We're on an evening ride out around the dark lanes. I think it'll complement the uh, the illumination of the roads. Uh, so that's about it, and then put the clock, the little clock from the uh, hunter. Not the hunter, the interceptor. Onto here. Um, so that's pretty much everything. So um, continue the ride, rest and rest of the way home now. Get some fuel on the way. Fuel lights just come on. Um, and yeah, as I say, I really do love this bike. Really love it. Um, it's just brilliant. So, let's get let's get on. Let's go and get some fuel. Then let's go.